China is rich in land and resources, and various landforms are crisscrossed, which has created many amazing road projects. People who like self-driving cars will be very concerned about the choice of routes. If the road is picturesque, it will naturally be full of joy, but if it is so thrilling that you need to tighten your nerves all the time, you have to laugh with tears? So do you know which roads in China are recognized as the most thrilling? Hi, everyone. Welcome to Hot Topics Time, a channel to interpret news from a new perspective and explore the wisdom behind the news. Before we start today's video, please subscribe to our channel, which is the encouragement that we can create more videos. In this video, let's take a look at these eight thrilling roads. The first is the National Highway 318. It is the legendary Sichuan Tibet Line, known as the Chinese Landscape Avenue. The Sichuan Tibet Line is a pilgrimage route for Chinese self driving enthusiasts. The Sichuan Tibet Highway is recognized as the most dangerous and scenic highway in China. There is a saying that the action is very clever, the Sichuan Tibet Line has four seasons, hundreds of miles of different days, and the scenery along the way is colorful. It crosses 21 snow capped mountains and spans 14 rivers. It is the most complex and unique alpine valley in the world. In areas, the road ahead will be higher and higher, which is prone to altitude sickness. Those who are not physically fit need to proceed cautiously. There are many people who want to challenge the 318 National Road, but you should exercise your body first. The second is the Dukul Highway. This is a steep sky road that crosses the mountains and ridges and runs through the Tian Shan Mountains from north to south. This is also a steep mountain road with thousands of gullies, one-third of the road is surrounded by cliffs, one-fifth of the road. Underneath is the permafrost of the high mountains, this is a heroic road paved by blood and sweat. After 10 years of road building, an average soldier died every 3 kilometers. Although the Duku Highway is very steep and the winter weather is harsh, the Duku Highway was closed for more than half a year in the middle of the year. The difficulty of self-driving is prohibitive, but there are still many self-driving enthusiasts who come here year after year because of this. The road is so beautiful. The third is the Tianmen Mountain Winding Road. Tianmen Mountain Highway is located on Tianmen Mountain in Zhangjiajie, Hunan Province, and has the reputation of being the sacred mountain in western Hunan. Due to the limitation of the unique geology and climate of Tianmen Mountain, the construction was started in 1998 and was not fully implemented until 2005. Zhangjiajie Tianmen Mountain Highway is known as Tongtian Avenue. This road is very short, with a total length of only 10.77 kilometers, but it attracts a large number of self-driving enthusiasts every year for sightseeing, because the scenery here is really hard to resist. The altitude has risen sharply from 200 meters to 1,300 meters. There are thousands of cliffs on both sides of the avenue, and the empty valleys are deep. There are a total of 99 turns. 180-degree turns can be seen everywhere. Everyone who drove here was frightened and sweated. The fourth is the Darim Desert Highway. The desert road runs through the Taklamakan Desert from north to south and is currently the longest road built in the mobile desert in the world. It is 522 kilometers long and 446 kilometers long through the mobile desert. For tourists eager to cross the Darin Desert, the Darin Desert Highway undoubtedly provides the best conditions. Self-driving through the entire desert will take about five hours. Along the way, you can see strange desert landscapes and thousand-year-old populous Euphratica. In this terrifying but beautiful desert full of stories, you can not only see beautiful but uncommon scenery, but also feel the treasures and memories of civilization on the road. The fifth is the National Highway 213. National Highway 213 is a famous north-south national highway in China. This path makes everyone who walks love and hate. As this road passes from the Great Northwest to the Great Southwest, you can see many inaccessible natural scenery along the way, 
and the breathtakingly beautiful primitive paradise makes people linger. But on this road, there are mountain roads almost everywhere. Especially after entering Sichuan, the thrills of Dujianjian section are well known on the internet, and it has been named one of China's top 10 life threatening sections. It is conceivable how difficult it is. Whether to take the 213 National Highway is a very worthy question. The sixth is the Yunnan Burma Highway. This is a road built with the hands of the elderly, children, and women. When Japan seized Vietnam and cut off the Yunnan Vietnam Railway, it became the only channel for China to receive foreign aid. Now it has become a compulsory course for many self driving travel enthusiasts to challenge themselves. The straight line distance from the foot of the mountain to the top of the mountain is about 350 meters, and the vertical height is about 260 meters. It is built in an S shape along the mountain on a slope with an inclination of about 60 degrees and the whole distance is about 4 kilometers. This scary corner, within a drop of nearly 300 meters, there are countless corners waiting for you, driving from here, you have to turn the steering wheel every 10 seconds, the most, you can see go to the 5 corners ahead. This road has also become a track for domestic self-driving travel enthusiasts to challenge the limit. The seventh is the Aizhai Panshan Highway. It is a section of Xianchuan Highway on the 319 National Highway connecting Chongqing in western Hunan. It is the only channel connecting the Guangdong Hanzhou Railway and Xiangui Railway to the rear of the southwest. Due to the steep terrain and vast engineering of the Aizhai Panshan Highway, it is known as the top highway construction in China. The Aizhai Panshan Highway is about 6 kilometers long. This section has 26 bends on a large mountain slope with a slope of 70 to 90 degrees. Its horizontal distance is less than 100 meters and a drop of 440 meters. There are 13 sharp bends with acute angles and 26 parallel sections up and down, so that vehicles traveling on them will move left and right to and fro at every turn, fearing that they may fall into the abyss if they are not careful. From a distance, it looks like a spring that is strongly compressed, about to eject. The last is the Guolian Tunnel. It was built in 1972 and was completed by villagers in Guoliang village independently and manually without any machinery. It lasted five years. In 1999, he just hammered out 26,000 cubic meters of stone in the cliff, claiming to be one of the impossible tasks in the world. It was open to traffic in May 1977 and the whole country was shocked. The 13 villagers who were mainly responsible for the excavation were called Guoliangdong 13 warriors. There are more than 30 windows in this tunnel. From the windows, you can see the abyss. The Guoliang Tunnel is known as one of the 10 most dangerous roads in the world and one of the 18 most peculiar roads in the world. Okay. That's all for today. Please put your comments below and share your insightful ideas with other people. Thank you so much for your continuous support. Your precious time with us is highly appreciated. Hot Topics Time, time to explore the wisdom behind the news. We will see you in the next video.